the interesting things about the salt marsh is that it has both uh, consumers from land, critters from land um, that forage among the plants when the tide is out and then when the tide moves in you get more marine consumers. In fact the two primary consumers of Spartina alterniflora or salt marsh cordgrass are a grasshopper and a snail. So the experiment that we're running right now at the FSU Coastal and Marine Lab is in these white mesh cages where some of them get grasshoppers only, some get snails only, while some of them get the two in combination, and then some with no consumers at all. The basic expectation would be that they do the same when they're together as they do when they're apart. But we know that some consumers um, can interact so that they inhibit each other's feeding. So maybe the snail leaves a slime trail that the grasshopper doesn't like to climb on, or maybe they somehow facilitate each other and the grasshopper bites chunks out of the leaves that make it then easier for the snail to graze. The tank setup that we have here at the Marine Lab is really nice in that we can increase the realism of the experiment by simulating high and low tide, just like uh, these organisms would experience in the field. So as you can see here, uh, this is high tide, as it typically would be about this time of day in St. Joe Bay. And pretty soon we'll shut the water off and it will drain out um, to, to simulate low tide for these organisms. The grasshoppers and the snails kind of leave their own little calling cards. So the grasshoppers take chunks, usually out of the side of the plant, and they'll leave kind of holes in the plant like this, or sometimes um, markings more similar to this, whereas the snails are a little more discreet. They just leave these thin, kind of razor-like cuts in the leaf that then the tissue around it can die. And so when we go back at the end of the experiment and are trying to determine who had the more dramatic effects, we can kind of quantify that by looking at the different grazing marks. <laughs> 